Hi everybody. I'm gonna try to show the pictures better this time. Um, it's time for session three, Birds with Marmy. Today, we might only get, last time we didn't really get 10. We may only get, I don't know, seven or eight because I can't make these videos very long. The first one we're gonna do today Everybody already knows it's going to be an easy one to learn because you know it. It's called the Great Horned Owl. You can just remember that's an owl. It's the Great Horned Owl. And uh, they make a sound and they go, hoo, hoo. And uh, some people think they're real smart. So sometimes people will say, he's as wise as an owl. Uh but those are great horned owls. I have a good story about this next one. He, oh, no, I don't. This one is called a bald eagle. He's the national symbol of America, bald eagle. Notice that um, the, the female's head is different, uh, but it's called a bald eagle. And Papa saw one in the backyard, and then we saw in the paper it was true. There was one. They don't hardly ever come here. But um, that's a bald eagle. Okay, this one is scary. Try not to be scared when I tell you this story, okay? He's, a, he's called a Cooper's Hawk. And you don't want to go around a Cooper's Hawk. They eat stuff. And they, they can't hurt people. But one was in our backyard... Uh, I saw it and it was eating a dove. Remember the dove I showed you? It was eating it. So I ran out and I shoot it away and it flew off carrying that dove because it was still eating it. But they're called hawks and they eat uh, smaller birds and they eat mice and stuff like that. So I'm going to go real close so you can look. Cooper's hawk. And um, you don't have to be scared of them because they were actually scared of me when I ran out there. But uh, they, they're they kind of, um, I don't know, they like to eat other stuff. Okay, the next one. This is one we have every January. They come to Plainview. And they come and drink water at our on our uh, bird bath. They're called... Cedar wax wings. They're only here in January for about a week and then they leave and I think they go north. I think they stop here on their way going north, but they're called cedar wax wings. And notice they have um, kind of a mask on. The thing that's interesting about them is you can't tell from the picture, but they're, they're real smooth. They kind of look like velvet. Uh, cedar wax wings. Okay, the next bird that we're going to study is the common grackle. He's really just more black, but they're the ones that get in all the trees, and there's thousands in, in one tree, and they get poop everywhere, so cities hate them, and they make, la but the it's against the law to kill one of these migratory birds. You can't kill them, uh, and you shouldn't kill birds anyway. And the only time you should ever kill a bird is if you're eating it. And hopefully we won't ever have to do that. Uh, but these are grackles. And we have them in those big pine trees behind our house. But um, they kind of make a mess. Most people don't like grackles. Okay, the next one is a cool one. It's called a quail. Now this is one that a lot of people eat. Uh, I think... Maybe Aunt Jessica's family does quail hunting. I've actually tasted a quail before, and it tastes kind of like chicken, <laughs> except wild chicken. That is called a quail, and they're kind of a bigger, bigger bird. They're not tiny, so you get me enough meat off of a quail, but that's what that looks like, and this one's actually called a California quail, but it lives in Texas, and, uh, well, wait, this one lives mostly farther west, but they all look like that. That's what a quail looks like, and the last one for today is called, I like these little birds. It's a wren. It's a little wren. See how his, the tail sticks up? 
Uh, they're tight. They're little, and they hop around, and they're called wrens. And you spell it W R E N, wren. Uh, and they're all over everywhere. People uh, in the south. They don't have them as much in the north. Let me see what it says. They like bushy, low uh, mesquites. You know those little trees called mesquite trees? Uh, that's the kind of place they like to stay. So those are called wrens. Okay, guys. That's all for today of Birds with Marmy. Session three. Bye. Keep remembering them.